check in. We're going to work straight into our Virgsasana tree pose. So we'll lift the right heel just above the ankle. Option to stay there. Option to slide the heel towards the calf. Maybe the heel comes above the kneecap. Some of you might want to reach down for the upper inner thigh. And as you hug in and root down, lengthen towards the ceiling. Feel free to keep the palms at the heart or extending your trunk, maybe branching out. So modifying your tree, perhaps taking hammock in the tree pose with the hands behind the head, elbows wide, slight back bend as you lift your heart towards the ceiling, that's an option. Option to take your right arm on top of the left, for eagle in the tree pose. Or to interlace the hands onto the shoulder blades and wiggle around. Tree fort with your friend in the tree pose. Oops, sorry, Olive. And <laughs> reaching the arms out like wings and swaying from the hips. Challenge your balance. Maybe close your eyes. And then slide that right foot down, shake it out. Walk over the toes. We'll take the opposite side. Rooting into the right foot, lift the left heel. Hug in. Find your drift to your concentration point. Heel can slide to the calf or above the knee or to the upper inner thigh. Good. Palms to the heart, both the elbows or standing in the trunk. You could lengthen over to the right. You can come back to the center, switch your grip, lengthen to the left. Inhale center. Come into your cactus, your Joshua tree, or interlacing the hands behind the back. Or the opposite eagle arm, grabbing the shoulder blades. Good. Play with it, don't just be static. And then, if you're still balanced, try closing your left eye. And keeping your left eye closed, try to close your right eye. Keep them closed, no peeking. See, exactly. And then exhale, release, walk over the toes. Nice reset, palms to the heart, deep breath. And not through the mouth. 